In the session today, we're going to terminate BNC Cream Pond Connector. This is the Cream Pond tool. Well, this tool will support RG59 and RG6. We're going to use the RG59 today. The second tool we can use is a stripping tool that make it easier to strip the cables. Today we use going to use standard scissors. So let's start beginning the termination. BNC Queen Pond connector had two parts. First part is the connector itself and then the second part is the jacket in the back of the cable. The jacket is the part that will lock the cable to the connector. Let's take a close look. This is the connector and this is the jacket in the back of the cable. Let's review RG59 CCTV cable. It has the outer jacket. Below it, it has the 95% copper braided shield and then the center conductor of the cable. This is a Siamese, the most common used cable for CCTV and security camera installation. It's two cable in one. The first cable is 18 by 2 power and then the RG59 coax. This cable is designed for easy installation when it carry both cable in one. This cable will support both power and coax to the camera. So you need to run only one cable from the DVR to the camera and that cable will include the power and the coax. Those cables are glued together so be, to be able to s terminate the coax we need to separate the two cables. To separate them we'll create a small cut between the cables and we'll and then we'll put it aside to separate them now in one side we have the coax cable the RG59 and the second is the 18 by 2 To start with the termination, we're going to take the back jacket of the BNC connector and slide it into the RG59 cable. We slide it all the way down so it's not going to, it's not going to disturb the installation. So it's not going to disturb the termination. Then we're going to create a tiny cut about half an inch from the edge of the cable. Make sure the cut is not too deep so it's not going to hurt the shielded part of the cable. After you create a cut, just pull the outer jacket. We're just separating. The We need to separate the shield from the center of the cable. So it's in no circumstances the shield is going to touch the, the center conductor. That will cause picture distortion. Now we need to strip the center of the RG59 connector the, of the RG59 cable sorry we'll take that and then we need to push this conductor into the back of the connector in the back of the connector there's a tiny hole just push it inside 
and then slide the back of the jacket on top of the shielded into the connector. Now the connector is ready for termination. We use the middle part of the of the crimping tool that designed for RG59 and with one strong press we terminate the connector. The termination is done. Th this connector is ready to use in any CCTV or security camera installation.